Hi, Jenny here. I've just been explaining to people the difference between all these different types of EM that exist, so I thought I should make a bit of a quick video here about it. Um, it gets really confusing when you're a new beginner. You have EM, you have EM1, you have EMA, you have uh, some different types of brand names in different places. In Asia you have EMS and you have CEM and uh, it drives you crazy. What are they all? Uh, in the beginning it made no sense to me at all, but it's actually quite simple. There is only one product in the whole EM world and it is called EM1 and this is the base product that every other thing comes from. So Bokashi brand is made from EM1. All the different types of um, liquid EMs that you can spray around, they're all coming from EM1. This is a very special product that's made in a laboratory. It's based on many years of research out of Emro, Japan, and we're only talking about the, the real official uh, EM uh, effective microorganisms product uh, that comes out of Japan here, not the homemade varieties, which is another subject. Um, and this is uh, EM1 is a, a combination of different types of microbe groups, uh, bacteria and fungus that work in a very special way together. I think I'll talk more about that in another video. So what are these products and why do they get activated? So these, these are the ones we have in Sweden. So this here is the EM1. This is the, the mother product of all EM products. This is made in a laboratory and it has your basic microbe groups in it. But it's actually dormant. The microbes here are dormant, so you can't use them directly. So to bring them to life, what we do is um, ferment them, which means mixing them with molasses. This uh, molasses is, this is Swedish, but whatever. It's molasses and it's EM1. And by mixing these two together with water and uh, leaving them in a warm place uh, for a week or two, you will have an activated version of EM. And that is the product that you will then use in the garden or that is used in agriculture uh, and so on. When we make Bokashi brand, we use these two products uh, and add water and um, wheat bran or rice bran or whatever to make that. When we use, want to make the liquid version uh, for spraying in the garden, we mix it purely with water in an airtight uh, container and then use that. Most countries, or many countries, sell a ready-made activated version which just makes life easier. And in Sweden we have this one here, which is called Microfirm. It can also go under the name of EMA, which stands for EM Active. Uh, and if you make it yourself using this and this plus water, you'll get EM active. Um, in Asia, it's often called EMUS, uh, Effective Microorganisms Activated Solution, and it's also called CEM in some countries, Concentrated EM. But basically, it's the activated version of these two. And what happens is that you get much, much, much more for your money. So you start with, uh, let's say, one liter of EM, this, and you get 20 litres and this and the molasses together and you get 20 litres of the activated um, version. If you use these two little guys, you get 5 litres of the activated EM. And if you buy it straight off the shelf, you get 2 litres bag and box or 1,000 litres if you buy a big one or 1 litre, depending on what you have in your country. This particular bag and box version that we have in Europe is quite interesting because uh, it's like wine, you know, it's in this plastic bag inside with the vacuum tap. And this uh, means that there will never be any air coming into the bag. And that means that it has a really long shelf life. Uh, this will hold for a year at least, um, sometimes longer, usually longer. If you make it yourself in a, um, a plastic bottle, you need to use it within a week. I'll go through the exact recipe for making this in a separate video. When you spray it out, the activated version, let's say you take this, you always use a dilution of 1 to 100, 1%, and that means 100 uh, milliliters, which is just this much, in a 10 liter watering can, which is the big watering can. Uh, here I've got the little watering can, and so that means it's just, you know, like a finger, finger depth of uh, EM in there with water. You can spray it out uh, onto your plants using a normal small spray bottle uh, or a bigger one that you connect to your hose, always in a 1% dilution. 
So that's the difference between these two guys and how you use them basically. But Active EM is the activated version and that is what you should always be using in your garden. These two here, EM1, which is the mother product, is basically only ever used for making the activated EM. So you're either make, using this to make Bokashi brand or you're using this to make uh, activated EM, which you can also buy ready activated. That's it.